Hello everyone, this is Dark Dimensions Haunted House, and it is Christmas time. And today, we have a few of our Christmas props that we're going to be working on. Here is Mr. and Mrs. Claus. These are some old items that I was given by my great-grandmother. I tried uh, asking my grandmother any information I could about these. They were handmade in about 1980. So that makes them about 40 years old. There's no other information on them. She thought maybe they might have some kind of signing on them or something. But as you can see, there is nothing on there. So in this video, I'm going to try to restore them to the best that I can. You can see that Santa has some of this uh, whitish kind of fading looking look. I thought maybe it was from the sun, but then I realized it was from where he would have his beard. They're missing their hair. You can see these little holes right here on their eyes, or underneath their eyes, and that's where they had glasses pushed in. I do have this little piece right here, it's a little brass wiring, and that is where they would be pushed in. But of course it's, it's broken. I also thought it was funny that, if you notice, Miss Claus doesn't have any legs, but Santa does have some legs. But of course my grandmother said it's because she's wearing the dress. Okay, so I went to the store to get a few items right there. It doesn't match exactly, but I bought a child-sized Santa hat for Santa Claus. I'm going to use E6000 glue at Hobby Lobby. They only had one pair, but they have these little glasses right here that I'm going to use for Santa. On eBay, on a costume shop, I found a Miss Claus little bonnet hat. For the hair, I tried finding hair to put on uh, Santa and Miss Claus, but I couldn't find any hair. But when I was at Walmart, they had these novelty glasses, these uh, Santa beard uh, novelty glasses, and they have the hair on there. They have the hair, they have the mustache, and they have the eyebrows right there. So I'm gonna, I bought several of these, so I'm gonna use these for the hair and the beard, eyebrows, all that, etc. So go ahead and grab yourself some cocoa and come join us as we fix Mr. and Mrs. Claus. So on these glasses right here, I'm gonna remove the eyebrows. There's for Santa. And for Miss Claus. Probably gonna trim them, they're pretty bushy. Then I'm gonna remove the beard and mustache. And I can get rid of these. Alright, so like the eyebrows on the mustache, I'm gonna have to do some trimming and on the other one I already removed it I can use this as his hair on top of his head and then on this one this beard piece take off the mustache part I don't need the mustache and this will work for Miss Claus's hair it looks a little bushy for me, a little too much. So. We'll get Miss Claus's eyebrows did. And then we'll glue those on there. And we'll see if it matches. And 
there we go. We'll glue those pieces on right there. Using the E6000 glue, this stuff is really good glue, really strong. This other side. All right, so let's see how she looks with her hair right there. This is the, like I said, this is the beard from the glasses. Now we'll get Miss Claus's bonnet. And we'll have the mistletoe go in the front part. And then whenever I get a, another pair of these glasses right here, but till then, So Santa, I'm going to go ahead and keep his bushy eyebrows. But as the mustache, I'll give that a little bit of a trim. Go ahead and fold that in the middle. Or better this way. So I think that'll work right there. Okay, so now I'm going to glue on the beard. So then the beard, it does cover up where it was, uh, where I thought it was faded. But that's probably just from the age of the old hair on there turning it kind of white. So now I will get the other piece. So now time to glue this. 
this on. There's a receding hairline. And Santa is an old man. I don't know how many years old he would be. But it's okay, because it'll be covered with his Santa hat. Child Santa hat, it should fit him. Now we're going to put some of these glasses on that I got at Hobby Lobby. These are a lot better than the, the old ones that came with them. I guess I'll do the way that they were on the old ones right there. I'll just cut that little curved part out. Thanks for watching this video of repairing Mr. and Mrs. Claus. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I'm hoping also that it'll inspire you to work on other projects and use your imagination to see what you can come up with. Hopefully my great grandmother and my grandmother will be proud of these and hopefully they'll last for another 40 years and my kids will take care of them as well. So once again, thanks for watching Dark Dimensions haunted house please like and subscribe as there's other videos where we repair other props for either Halloween or Christmas in this case.